Yo, good morning, year 10. Jim Roberson here. Yo, my lovely friend, Mr. Barnard, asked me if I'd just do a little catch-up with you lovely folks um, based on the session we had. And I uh, just want to go over a couple of things. Yes? Number one, you know, just making sure, man, that you're taking all this time, that you check yourselves. It's a really crazy time with this virus. But you have a lot of time to make sure that you can take care of your business. And number one starts with you. Checking yourselves, making sure you're getting things right, making sure you're keeping yourselves prepared. Just a couple of things I want to review with you. When I met with you, it was about exam preparation. When you lovely folks get into school next year, you will be in year 11. It will be exam preparation. Just want to give you some things to think about right now. Number one, folks, it's about well-being. Make sure you're taking care of yourselves. We need to stay inside. We need to think about the social distances. But what's really important, man, is that you take care of yourself spiritually, that you take care of yourself mentally, and keep yourself going during these crazy times. Number two is that you have a plan. You got a lot of time to plan for next year and making sure you're getting some things right. Make sure you take your time. Make sure you make your plan. Number three is that you practice. You got a load of time now, making sure that you practice things that you might need to get up on for next year, and I'll go over that in a little bit. But making sure you're staying on top of your practice, utilizing your time. Hey, you will lead to a point next year where you have to perform. We can be way ahead of the game. This time right here can be vital to making sure you get yourself right. I call these the three Ps. Remember, plan, practice, and at some point you will have to perform and you will be ready to perform. I want to move along to something that we talked about, time management. Really a big key right now. Hey, time management is an adult skill, but that you use the time right now to really manage your time. You're not in school. Make sure that you manage your time properly and get something out of your time. Your eight hours sleep, at least. Some of you lovely folks are going to be getting 10, 12 hours sleep now. That's fantastic because you got the time. Eight hours for school. You're not in school. But what we like to do is talk about maybe having two hours a day as your school time. Yeah, breaking that up into 30 minutes. And making sure that you're getting your school time in and you keep going with your lessons. That eight hours free now, folks, is really about 12 hours free of absolute free time. Making sure that you utilize your time to get something out of your time. The thing I'm talking about, think, take your 30 minutes, take all your lessons, folks, and maybe condense them into 30 minutes. And if you take your two hours, that's four 30 minute sessions. In those 30 minute sessions, you review your past work, review your previous work, make sure you get all that right. Something new, you got loads of research time, loads of time you can work on, find new things out, get yourself ready for next year. And that last thing is five minutes to test yourself, folks. We'll call that show you know. You got a great time to put in your show you know because next year will be show time. And that's what it's all about, show you know. Remember, folks, your education is the key to unlocking opportunities. We can be ready for next year. You can be on well on top of the whole deal for next year if you utilize this time properly. Again, thank you, Mr. Barnard, for giving me the opportunity. Year 10, enjoy yourselves. It's a crazy time, man. Make sure you take care of your business. Yo, get yourselves ready for next year. Thank you.